Good morning, morning viewers. Good <laughs> morning, viewers. Good morning. It's early, early. It's six in the morning. We are at a closed McDonald's. <laughs> I know, it's not, so tragic. It's so, so upsetting. Sad. Not what we intended. It's currently 20 past six in the morning, and um, we're on our way to Shelsey Walsh Hillkine. In this! In this! We've been led the TT by Starter Motor once again, and this time it's. It, was it sunny the day we drove it? It wasn't this sunny. Then we shall be uh, getting our way down there. It's about an hour and a half away from us. Um, we'll swap over halfway. And then we'll show you the many things that Chelsea Walsh Shell Climb has, has to, to offer, offer, in which we know nothing about. Do you no, know anything? Do you know anyway, anything about that? No, I don't. I but don't it's, one of the, it's one of the most famous hill climbs. Oh, the drive through is open. It's one of the most famous, <laughs> it's one of the most famous hill climbs in the country, and um, we're going for the day as Starter Motor ambassadors, aren't we? We are. We've got little badges to, to say that, and they're in there somewhere. But okay. Yes, we'll see you there. We'll see you there. We've arrived. We've arrived at Shelsey Walsh Hill Climb. The starter motor stand is over there. We've parked the TT on it. We have these. It's all very official, and we're just we're just watch, we're just ogling at everything that's turning up at the minute. There are some. <gasps> Go that you. Sounded like it had a bike engine. Anyway, there are some mega things here, so um, we're just going to do a walk and talk. I will be keeping these on for the remainder of the video because I have severe hay fever. So let's go have a walk around for the things. Uh, now this, I, want, I did want to mention this quickly because this is a bit standout for me. If this is... Real. If this is what it actually is and not just in this livery. Would you know by the number plate? Mm, probably not. But it, I mean, it's got all the Lombard Rally stuff on it, but this is a Lotus, a Lotus Sunbeam and it's proper Andrews livery. And that looks... So it could lovely. be the real one, it could it not could be. could be the real thing. I think it would probably, I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. These are pretty. Look at the XK120. I love wheel covers. That is just a way to get about, isn't it? It's just cool. And and uh, we we haven't seen it yet because I think it's under covers, but there is a Lancia 037 in, in this there, bar. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can just see a little mind tempted. <laughs> Stay away. <laughs> oh, that's to see that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bonnet straps for me. I love bonnet. Look at the holes in the bonnet. <laughs> you can see the that's entering box. Look at that. You can see. It says Jaguar Type C in it. 11th overall. In Le Mans. Wow. Okay. So this is a proper, proper, proper one. This is a literal Le Mans competing Jaguar SK120. Now, do you want to talk about this? Because you, you like this. Yes. Now, this is a Toyota 2000 GT with the number plate. 2000 T Wife Toyota. So, that's probably worth a fair penny. I think they were saying there's 400 something of these. I think about 400, and it's definitely oh, okay. six yeah. figures, if not seven. And it is by far and away the best looking Toyota ever made. Oh, yeah, yeah. And cool, cool fact for people who won't know, but it is a it is a thing. People probably well, people who know know, and people who don't know know, but that's how most facts go. <laughs> <laughs> Alliteration. <laughs> uh, they built a one-off convertible for Sean Connery in the James Bond film because he was too tall to actually sit in the coupe one. And then and your personal favourite. <laughs> now this, ladies and gentlemen, is a Subaru Impreza. David Withers, FaceTime video. <laughs> he's over he's, actually, he's over there. David! <laughs> he's actually not on FaceTime right, yet. Shall I have a chat about Withers. the 22? Yeah, you go, I'll go. Right, ladies and gentlemen. Ben's just gone to find David. I want to talk about this. Because this is so fun. I don't want to say it's my favourite, but it's definitely a standout for me. This is a Zubra Impreza 22B. Now this is like the, the creme de la creme of Zubru and Pretzels. Yeah, it doesn't really get much better. 
than that if you're into your Imprezas or your JDM stuff or your rally cars and that's I think they're I think I could be very wrong I think they're worth about a quarter of a million pounds yeah right so again we're looking for we're, we were literally just on our way to get some coffee and we walked past this now if this is what I think it is it's it's a Maserati 300s and it's X Fangio I think if I'm I could be completely wrong but I think this car is currently for sale with Fiskins but yes this is the X Fangio Maserati 300s and it is absolutely stunning um, you just found out where to get coffee yeah. oh look at that ah. that looks like a I don't even know show them it's, it looks you're like just your face right now I know so there you go this wasn't here a minute ago it looks like a 330 what is it db5 or 4 db5 or 4 I need to see the front of it this looks like a 330 is it a 330 I think it is a 330 yeah but it looks a bit longer than a 330 <laughs> yes yeah, don't get me wrong yes it's absolutely stunning but um I'm sure we'll find out I think that's a five, Ben, or a very late four. Five. Or is it five? It's, it's, uh, it's a four. It's a four GT. I think. Yeah. With the bonnet scoop and the. Your job, your, your job to work out what more cars here. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Basically, right. yeah. Well, yeah. Our yeah. job is to walk around with this Points and. Things and go, that's one of those. <laughs> yeah, and then probably get it wrong. <laughs> So the next car that's coming up is a bowler. I'm not sure what kind of bowler. Excuse me. <laughs> I am Zagat. <laughs> <laughs> So this is our quick wrap up outro, but summarize what we've done today. We saw another hill climb, different to Wiscombe because it was just like the range of cars today. Yeah. Literally all the way back to pre-war, all the way up until a Ferrari Roma, which was delivered probably six months ago. So we have to thank Haggerty for actually putting the event on. Yeah. We also have to thank Starter Motor for letting us drive down in their car. Letting eh? us drive down in their car and, and staff passes. getting us into the event. In which, for those who aren't driving, yes, I he's am, driving I am home. Driving. That's why he hasn't got a ticket. I, um, I, I had a sign. Yes, um, we'll link Starter Motor below. Again, it's a donation run charity, so if you do want to donate, please on the website, do. Have a look at it, see what it's all about. Yeah, because you. As individuals, anyone between, I can't remember what the edge is, but anyone between 18... Under 25, I think. Under 25 could be driving a TT. That Jag's just come in, the Singer. You you know, get in touch if you want to drive a vintage car. That's what they're here for. That's what they're trying to do. Yeah. Um, so, and so, yeah. So, thank you very much for watching. And we'll see you in the next one. We will. Ciao, ciao.